All right, I'm back. We're starting in here just because I finished training. Uh, you may notice I have Tyrant. You may have saw for a frame. Tyrantrum's here. That is not a mistake. <laughs> also, our level cap is now 145. It keeps going up. Well, I've been trying to fix it, Marcello. You gotta... You gotta give me time, bud. <laughs> oh shit, I also gotta get Giratina Nature. Unless it's just... I kinda want Spadef boosting. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, generally on smaller maps, the speed up works a lot better. Which is why on smaller maps, it may seem like I'm going faster. Because I am! Quite literally, going faster. Yeah, Giratina is bulky. I need another Pokemon that can just sort of be a fat fuck, I guess is the term I want to go with. Because I'm going to need some bulky Pokemon going into the end game. And Giratina is actually a decent fit. Especially given that under Glitch Train, for example, it becomes immune to Fairy, Dark, and Steel. Holy shit, where's the end? Okay, there's the end. There we go, let's go in this new world. Let's go in this new world. Let's see how Terra fucked it up. Pretty normal so far. Gonna quickly grab the cell imprints that I can grab. Oh yeah, I should probably max up Giratina's IVs. Hmm. Yeah, here. What, d don't you dare take my Zygarde. That's... Son of a bitch. She stole my Zygarde. <sighs> yeah, I'm bringing you. <sighs> you know, I have to actually admit that's clever. 
somehow I don't think it's going well. So, yeah, and this is why I had Tyrantrum. This is why I have Ty- This is why I have Tyrantrum. <laughs> I really just need something to nuke. This is Moxie, isn't it? Well, if it's Mega, it's gonna evolve immediately. Yeah, it's gonna evolve. Okay, cool. Is this special Mega Gyarados? Oh wait, no, it gets to run both, I forgot. Does it have Blizzard? It does, okay. It has EQ... You know what, we're just gonna... Oh yeah, this is my set, by the way. Very much a gimmick. You know, if I was smarter, I would have chosen to go into Zekrom. And, you know, used... Oh shit, right, no, I didn't bring Zekrom because... Duh. <laughs> Tight mismatch for this terrain. Well, that's unfortunate. Well, time to use our new team member, Giratina. Uh, does this thing have Toxic? It probably does, honestly. Yes, it does, but we also have Toxic. And we have Rest, so... Well, that kills that. This is gonna do no damage. Oh. But yeah, that's a problem. See, I was kind of wanting Zygarde to deal with that Deoxys attack. So we're bringing back Dragonite. Specifically banded. You have Brick Break, right? No, that's fine. Um, and then I'm just thinking, who do I want to lead? Can't believe Anna turned out to be a villain. It's almost like I was predicting this the entire post game. Just just click the head smash button, it's funny. I wonder if Giratina could actually stall it. Let's find out. That's not doing enough. Well, that did enough. Okay.
So he did get a physical defense boost, which means it might still live. Yep. And multi-scale is not enough at that point. But it's okay! What's this Pex gonna try? Blizzard spam and knockoff spam, got it. Good thing Dialga and Palky also become huge special tanks. Knockoff? No. Switch here. I'm really hoping we Yoko this. We did not. The Aura Sphere has to kill from here, otherwise I lose. Or you're faster and kill me. Okay, Dragonite's not worth it. I could go for a 10% Zygarde. But I think I have a slightly better idea. Wait, no, we probably need Dragonite, actually, because I just realized that Deoxys attack has huge special defense, too. Maybe I'll use an EV tuner to try and get HP instead of speed. Maybe that'll help live. Cause two should kill. At least this start is somewhat consistent. And if your team doesn't get frozen, that's actually great. We do also have the option of burning that Gyarados. But it has enough physical offense that I, I don't think that m would be a good idea. I, it has enough special attack that it's not worth it. So now we're status immune for a couple turns. Uh, Giratina is our sacrifice here. Well, that's interesting that he actually lives effectively. That's actually really interesting. Yeah, because Bandy Speed might kill. Pax is just gonna spam Blizzard. <sighs> I hate that this team is literally just fishing for Blizzard procs. You've gotta be kidding me. That might kill us.
He doesn't use recovery, still have a chance. Or we somehow pull that off. Uh, I actually want to save Dragonite for the Gyarados. Let's hit it with a Surf first, see how much that does. Still too much. I was trying to not trigger that ability. Something like Flamethrower might work for that. Well, that still gets it done. And Gyarados should be a low enough that Bandit E speed. Woo! Zygarde. Okay. <laughs> Sus. <laughs> God damn it. I will be back. Oh, I hate this. Be right back. Fucking finally. I I ended up just restarting a bunch until I got a seed that actually worked. DNA splicers. <laughs> okay, I need to actually see. Is my Zygarde the same Zygarde? Wow, well, it is. Give Zekrom his choice band back. Woo! That's Zygarde 100% done. Now, into hell we go for the next quest. You know, I actually agree. Man sometimes does not have a brain. So it's up on top of the mountain. I wonder if... Yeah, this thing's on snowy. It's doubles too. Oh, that's actually worse. Well, let's see if this works. Because, yeah. Okay, double icy wind. Got it. Is this the way to go up in you two Zygarde again? No, I'll be back once I get it again. I'm back. I decided to just debug it because I couldn't get the puzzle done within another half hour. I have a gimmick. So, yeah, this is Snowy Mountain Field, which is the single worst terrain it could be. However, Primal Kyogre's Rain 
stops us from nuking the terrain away instantly. But, we have a Pokemon that's very interesting in this aspect. We have Meg we have normal Altaria. I'm hoping this still speeds. Oh thank god. Because Altaria makes it so that no weather is applied. I get to still use <laughs> That is the single worst strategy I think I've ever done. Okay, let's get rid of Mega Ray now. <laughs> he, he he's he's not staying here. Now, yes. Wait, we don't even. Yeah, cause it always has. Never mind. We don't even need that part. Okay. Well, the terrain's gonna be back up. Never mind, it went for Veil. That's actually amazing. That's actually amazing. Wait, how big is Zygarde's stats, anyway? 917 HP! Yeah, we're not living that. It's okay. Look, I'm just hoping Giratina's bulky enough to outlast this Primal Kyogre. Oh, we get 100% by default! Yeah, I think I'm gonna like this. It's okay. Snowy Mountain comes back. Eveltal, Darkrai. <laughs> Bye, Giratina. <laughs> oh, yeah, this... Okay, okay, so we don't need to gimmick it. I was stupid and forgot Mega Ray has his own weather. Altaria was so close to having a use. I. <laughs> I'm honestly. It's, it's very funny to me. Okay, let's get a. Scarf. So I can... No. On Zekrom. So I'm thinking if I don't have to have a dead Pokemon slot to just keep the weather away. Because let's be honest, Altari was not doing jack shit to actually help us. Kill. Slaughter. I don't care if he dies in one hit. Well, that I care about. <laughs> Whenever I have a good idea, the game always spites me. There is also the option, in theory, of just playing through this weather. I don't like that option because Icy Wind and Rock Slide are on every single Pokemon here. Let's see if Zekrom dies in one hit. Yes, he does. Okay. 
So it may be worth it to attempt to Mega Ray Outrage. Honestly, though, I rage should kill either of them from Zekrom. It doesn't. I'm actually shocked it doesn't. Well, it kind of does, I guess. Bye, Primal Kai. Bye, Palkia. I can also start thunder spamming on this terrain. I was really hoping I'd prevent Veil. Okay. I think we still lose. Yeah, we do. That's why this battle is really, really tough for us because you know I could nuke Mega Ray with a Draco, honestly. I think nuking the Kyogre out is more important. Just because I have less on my team that deals with him. Well, at least in such an immediate fashion. Yeah, I have to Draco the Ray. <laughs> There's no option there. Okay, used Blizzard again. Ugh. That kills our strategy immediately because we need that terrain gone. Okay, it's that's Veil here. Interesting choice. So he has two Pokemon left, just the Dark Rai Evil Tall. That did so little to the Dark Rai. What the fuck is its nature? Timid? Well, the oh yeah, it's not the Ox attack, right? Okay, I'm gonna go see about... Reshram might actually be a good option as well. For once, Reshram might actually see play. Probably over Giratina, it's really hard to stall in a... Just thinking... I don't think Blue Flare auto melts. But I could probably go get like Heat Wave to do that. Or honestly, having a life or Palky in the back with like Thunder might not actually be a bad idea.
not be a bad idea. Hmm. Yeah, I, I figured this fight would be a problem. It might use Earthquake now. I... <laughs> no, it's still using Icy Wind, okay. Uh, do you go before the Kyogre? No, okay, so I need Timid. I need Timid to speed tie it. Which really sucks. Because I'm pretty sure Reshram is base 92. Oh, what? You're... Oh, that's right! It's because I was running the really weird set. Because your special coverage is just awful. Yeah, but now there's a... Well, actually, you know, if I kill Kyogre... If I kill Kyogre... Well, we're gonna go for this. That doesn't kill. Oh! That's why it doesn't kill. Oh, that's a problem. Well, it might work out. Uh, Zygarde? Look, I'm just hoping we can finish this fight before. Like, the mountain becomes snowy again. That's gonna hurt or kill. Okay. I think we win at this point. Oh my god. That was such a lucky battle, I can't lie. Okay. Now it's time for roaming hell.
I, I hate roamers. Wait. Ooh. Okay. Uh, we might be able to get that. It's just frustrating to get roamers. You know. Luckily this one is. How do I put this? More than worth it. I will chase you down to the end of the earth, fucker. Oh, oh shit. I will chase your ass. Don't make me. Is it change on me getting an encounter? No. <gasps> okay. Oh, wait, wait. I'm just gonna go grab a random Pokemon that's like level 70 ish. Because I could easily just breed one. But I just need it to be high enough that random encounters don't appear on this route. But low enough that Rayquaza will still appear, so... This Magnezone should work. I'll be back when I encounter it. See you then. I finally did it. I've been using Magnezone to repel Trick. He got hurt because he couldn't run away from one of the battles while experimenting with not repelling. Get in the ball. <laughs> okay, that's Rayquaza done. No, you're not balling. And there's Rayquaza! <laughs> Those IVs are so bad. Oh well. That's it for this episode. Next episode, I'm gonna be, uh... getting the uh ne next episode is going to be a bunch of other quests gear team is only really going to come off we need bulky i feel but yeah that's it for this episode see you guys next time peace